Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Marie Peters and I am the author of the Tooth Fairy Chronicles series. Um, today I thought I'd do something a little bit different. I am in my Plan Perfect Traveller's Notebook. You've seen this one before. Um, I have my monthly pages at the back I have all my master lists, master shopping list, cleaning list, things I need to know about my husband's medication and that will fill up as we go along. I have this book here, Write a Better Story, and what I do is any books that I buy for my Kindle, make a note of them and tick them off when I've read them. So I'm hoping to fill that up at some point. But what we're looking at today is my journal. Now I've been watching some journaling YouTube channels. Now I've started this one on the 18th of February so I sort of fell out of the habit of it and at first I was just using mainly Happy Planner stickers. Sometimes I'd write sideways, have stickers down the edge and it was okay but I must admit I got bored of it. I mean it was always the same and so I sort of like fell off the wagon. April sort of like was hit and miss. May we'd gone from the 3rd to the 16th to the 25th. And then we did nothing until June so basically a month without anything and this is where I started to change my planning style. I'm not so daunted by so much white space that I need to fill in and it's like scrapbooking and journaling and making everything absolutely beautiful. So I have over a decade's worth of craft supplies hoarded around the house. So I've been running around trying to find everything so that I can make beautiful pictures. Now, I've only got a couple of pages left in this one now. So I thought for July, today's a 30th of June. So I use those and then I've only got those left. I will fill that up at some point but I thought for July I would start a new journal and this is what we're going to set up today. So I have a few options. I get the planner perfect subscription box and every month you get a new journal and I've also got some blank craft paper covered ones they're all blank books I thought that I'd start a new one um, obviously that one's out of season that one is for May so I hopefully use that next year I've got Prayer Warrior. Let's go on an adventure. And these two are a different size. These are in the wide size. And these are in the narrow, so they're slightly smaller. And I thought I would use this one. It's July, summer. 
I love this one, but this can be used at any time of the year. So I'll save the wider ones. For another time. And I'm going to use the narrow one. So what I am going to do first is set up my cover page. Now everything I, that I have, as I said, is so old. Most of it's probably from Amazon. But if you have any queries about anything, I will try and get back to you. I've got a pack of ephemera. I've got some papers, stickers. I've got so much stuff that I want to use. Washi tape, journaling cards, as you can see. Some of these things have never been opened. I think I'm going to put that there. Now you can use all sorts of paper in here. I've got a bit of an old map. I've got pattern pieces. I've got book pages, I've got music pages. to use as long as this isn't completely dried up I am going to use this Timothy Holtz distressed ink it is in the antique linen and I'm just gonna go around the edges of this packing label just so it's not so bland. Now I have some old typewriter stamps. I know that I got these from Hobbycraft here in the UK. Now the challenge is to see whether I can stamp in a straight line. Not too bad. I'm quite pleased with that. I'm going to use this stencil. Just a fine liner that I have. There we have it, July 2021. Right, I'm going to put my backing papers down first. Again, using the same tape that I always do, Stationery Island blue tape that I got from Amazon.
I'm going to fix this one with one of these brads. I've had these for years as well. going to take a sharp pair of scissors to poke a hole. It would help if I only had one sheet of paper. I'm not worried about that because when I do those pages, I will use something to cover them up. Okay. So that is lovely. Some of my favourite washi tapes here. I do like to layer for texture. got these stickers from Amazon.
seeing I've covered up most of this washing, I'm going to put another bit over here and that will help hold I think I am done cover page I'll be hopefully showing you flip throughs and doing some more journaling as we go along I like symmetry so I've got the butterfly butterfly little butterflies the flowers and the flowers I'm not that keen on the colour that I've used for the, the year, but it's only one month and I can live with it. I'm still new at this, so I'm learning. But hopefully you enjoyed that. I look forward to doing more journal with me's in the future. As always, thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you next time. Bye.